Hey guys, welcome back to Tanks Gaming. Um, today I thought I'd bring you a uh, MechWarrior Online video. <clears throat> it has been quite some while since I played it. Um, I think about a year or so. Because my cho joystick died and I haven't got a new one yet. And it's not quite that much fun to play it with the mouse and keyboard, in my opinion. Here's my differ. Uh, anyway, uh, I thought because on Thursday the 10th it released on Steam, I thought I'd give it another try, hop in in, my, in one of my mechs and do another battle. Uh, why not do a video about it and show it to you guys? So, here we have the, the menu stuff. We could go into tutorials, testing grounds, titles and badges. I will check this stuff all out of, off camera. Uh, we have the inventory, so we go to select the Mac, and you can see I actually have a few Macs left. I have four different Macs. Doesn't really... That doesn't really is true. <laughs> Those are all trial Macs, but you can play with trial Macs as well. You can also play with mediums, that's all trial. Did I bought, bought a heavy? Did I lose my heavy? I thought I had a Founders package. Well, anyway, so I just have this Raven, uh, Raven X4. So I'm going to choose that one. I'm not a really good light mech player, guys. Uh, as far as I, rem as I remember from Mech Warrior Online, I played all from Mech Warrior 2. I played all the Mech Warriors so far. I'm a pretty huge Mech Warrior fan. Uh, I'm really hoping someday there will be another Mech Warrior game, not just like the, the the online version, which is basically like World of Tanks or Armored Warfare or War Thunder and stuff like that. Uh, massive multiplayer online game. Uh, I would like to get another real. Uh, would be nice if it's a AAA title, but. If another company does it and does it good, uh, or an indie company does it, but I guess indie company won't be able to do it because of the uh, how you call it, because they won't have the rights to do it. So I'm hoping that Piranha Piranha Games might someday come around and brings us another Mech Warrior 5, or even a Mech Warrior 4. Another expansion pack would be nice as well. The graphic of Mac Warrior 4 is old. <laughs> it didn't age very well, but it's not that bad. Um, the game is still fun to play. Uh, unfortunately, I wasn't able to play it on Windows uh, Windows 8. Um, I tried it, I installed it, I could start to play. I couldn't get into the Mac Bay, I couldn't do any changes to my Mac. And uh, I think after I played for an hour or two, uh, I could save it, I could get out, uh, but after a two, uh, one or two days when I was playing again for a couple of hours, uh, my system crashed completely and I actually had to do a complete new install of my whole system. I couldn't get any backup or anything and because MechWarrior was the last game I installed, I guess that's what caused it. Uh, MechWarrior 4 Mercenaries, that was. So I don't know why the loading is taking so long, but I'm going to bring you back as soon as it's done. And we're back guys. Uh, sorry it took a while, my client actually crashed, but I'm pretty sure that has nothing to do with the game. That's more my crappy internet connection. Because I went, uh, I all tapped out and started Task Manager to see if uh, the game had crashed. The game was actually still running, but I couldn't do anything for about 15 minutes. It was just stuck on the loading screen. So that's why I actually... Uh, um, re I, I closed the game with a, a task manager and then I actually went back and uh, restarted it. And I just chose the Mac which was uh, chosen. So I can bring you a little bit of gameplay footage as well. Oh, uh, you see my internet is really crappy. I've got a ping of 129. But I can't do anything about that at the moment. So I think I'm in a squad in a, yeah, I'm I'm in alpha squad with 
I, I think that's all light max. Sensors online. Online. All systems nominal. She should. She's. She is such a nice person. <laughs> so uh, I hope some time I can turn off this arrow key. That's kind of irritating uh, on the ground, which shows which direction my mech is facing. It's probably pretty helpful, but well, yeah. Do I have chump chats? Should figure that out pre pretty soon, I guess. I get machine guns. I get rockets. I got two medium lasers, which is not quite a lot, guys, but it's better than nothing. Uh, this is actually a little... S Ooh, damn! I'm nearly done! Bug and weave! Bug and weave! <laughs> and there I go! Ah. Oh. <laughs> Did I do at least a little damage? I did 39 damage. <laughs> well, I tried to bring you another gameplay video. So we're back, guys, and that's new. That was that wasn't uh, in the in the version I played before. You can uh, actually choose map. You can choose uh, the mode before the actual game starts. Uh, I did one in my little Raven, but um, yeah. Like I said, I haven't played it in a couple of months, uh, probably for about a year, <laughs> and I blew up in the first 30 seconds. I did about 39 damage overall, I hit one enemy mech with one laser burst, a little bit of machine gun fire, and that was about it. So this time I choose uh, the, where are we, the SCR Prime, which is a medium mech. Uh, it's a trial version. Uh, if I remember correctly, when I played it last, the trial max are get switched out from time to time. You can choose different max. Uh, like one time there will be an Atlas, next time there is another mech like a like a Mad Cat and stuff like that. Anyway, f the, today the there was one of these four max is this one, and we actually get the Moon or Ice Planet base, which is. Pretty nice, uh, meaning your mech isn't overheating that fast. Um, if I press Q, I can see. I already, I already see it. So I got just two weapon groups with this mech. I got the CMAD Plus Laser, uh, Pulse Laser, uh, on the group one, and uh, the same laser again at the group two. I don't know why I, which, why it's grouped in these two groups. So probably you don't fire all your lasers at once. Let me check how fast far we can zoom in. Just the normal two times zoom thing. Uh, medium pulse laser. I think it's. I'm not quite sure, guys. I don't remember it exactly. I definitely have to do something with the mouse sensitivity. That's just way too sensitive. Okay, I can't. I have no jump chats. I cannot jump over that. There you see the shadows of my Mac. Okay, he has some rail guns, I would say. Those were. Ooh, boy. Okay, he is pretty damaged already, so we go back into cover over here. We move up again a little bit. Ooh, there he is. That wasn't smart. I should have taken cover. I will take cover now. I'm I'm not doing that great either. You see the damage in the lower left corner. I, I'm playing a Stormcrow. SCR Prime is a Stormcrow. Okay, that's nice to know. Which one do we choose? This one over there. Nope. Couldn't hit him. That's a friendly. There is one. He's not doing so great either. I think now there is a building in the way. Target Which target? There is the target. 
He's not doing great either. Ooh, but... I need to get in cover and I was too slow again. But I did 229 damage. I got some spotting assist. Uh, I got by, damage by ghost rifle, by uh, rocket streak, medium laser, large laser, pulse laser, and an AC-10. <laughs> So that was quite fast as well, but anyway guys, for this video, uh, I leave it at that, I will play a little bit more, try to get better with mouse and keyboard, and in a couple of days I will pl uh, I'll bring you another Mech Warrior video where I hopefully do much better. Uh, otherwise, um, I will order myself a new joystick um, anyway, because I need one for other games as well. Um, but that probably will be after Christmas, so if there is not another Mac Warrior Online video before Christmas, there will be one for sure after Christmas. So, thank you for watching guys, I hope you enjoyed the video, if you did, you can hit the like button, you can also subscribe to my channel for more daily videos. And you also can follow me on Facebook. So hopefully I see you next time. Thanks for watching and bye.